shit. Oh, come on, that's a major, uh, you 
you ever saw a DJ Carter, did you? No, never. On the tennis court? No, never. And he never seen you, but he was I'm the greatest guy you ever. I really talked about this. I, I've never seen anybody can you do a little blow. I don't know if you're ever in person. How are you? Come on, you're pretty experimental, Al. No, you, come on. Listen to this show. You're probably one step away from doing a blow. We're the two longest married guys in the army, right? We are, and also very straight. Well, he's straight like me as well. Yeah, exactly. I haven't touched that stuff in years. That's why I love it. You're the exact best. Underneath this rock and roll veneer, I have regular guys. Very good. Now listen to me. Ow. Ow. It's exciting that you're here. I gotta take a break. Yeah. And when we come back, let's not during the commercial, let's not talk about the OG phone call. We won't with Peter Jennings at night. No, we want to do it first on the air. Oh, yeah, we want to we want you taking us through it step by step because you were there that night. You were part of history. I'm a one play, of, I'm a play-by-play now, so you, what we'll do. You are part of one of the greatest phone calls. And you had uh, the cops. It was uh, uh, almost a race. It was a, ca a case of defense and offense. You're, you're right. Uh, true? Well, it's, it's uh, like somebody said, uh, Michael, is, Michaels is calling it. Now he's at the 10, he's at the 5, he's at the 405. Right. You know, <laughs> that's that's zone. But Peter uh, Jennings, obviously. You, I mean... Was Peter awake? That's yeah, if they don't tell him what to think, I got a feeling. You know, most of these news guys, Have and you, you know it. Have you ever seen him speak on his own? Yeah. Did you ever see anybody working him from behind like a <laughs> dummy or well, something? No, I mean, I, I, I know the minute this thing starts, I said, oh, boy. Uh -oh. I, I, well, you know what? You know what? The first thing that comes into my mind, I mean, I'm trying to think of a hundred things. I'm trying to, you know, lend perspective to it. I'm trying to tell people where OJ is. And again, we're in a situation where I can't see the people in New York. And right. Right. Everybody is uh, sort of a loose end at this point. Right. But, but when you hear the, a guy come on uh, and say, Hello there. Oh, Robin. Well, <laughs> look at here. You know, the first, I, I'll be honest. The first thing that comes into my mind is this is the World Trade Center all over again. <laughs> right. You know, because the World Trade Center, <laughs> someone got either, through it. So. Captain Janks. Right. Or, you know, it's one of the guys. Or one of the guys. Right, right. You know, I, I just sort of know it's going to be one. I know it's one of the guys. All right. And, and when it went on for how long did you think I've got to do something? Yeah, are you trying to break in the whole time and get words of Peter Janks? Well, not really, because I'm thinking to myself, I mean, I. I Truth, be, how, truth yeah. be told, I, you know, I know that my day of reckoning in the studio is going to come. Yeah, that's all I'm thinking about. Right, 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 right. Because right. you're, you're part of history. No, no matter what I do, and the, the key thing to me was, do I do, a, do I or do I not mention your name? Yes, right. that's what I was going to ask exactly. you. I said, I think you played it right. I, well, I, yeah. So I, I did it was a hard call. It was a real hard On one hand, I wanted to, but I felt if I did, a lot of people would, would be you know, turned off to you.